Alright guys, I've had uh, several inquiries about the uh, greenhouse we made here out of the carport and wanting some more details on it. I'll try to do the best I can. Um, if I don't answer all your questions, just let me know and I'll, I'll try to answer them the best I can. But Anyway, this is just a carport frame um, that we set up and then all this metal down here is from a uh, this is from a barn I tore down and just saved the metal back. It's too good a metal to get rid of, so here I use it for something. And the reason I went ahead and used this metal, you know, and came up here is I have six boys. And when they're mowing, they don't pay attention. So, you know, I figured, you know, if they're going to be throwing rocks and this and that, I'd rather hit the metal and go through the plastic. So that was kind of my theory behind that. Um, this winter or towards fall or whatever i'm going to come in and get some foam board and insulate these sides all the way around and everything that way i got keep it warmer in here in the winter um you know on this carport you need to make sure you tape over anything sharp edges and everything seams that way it does not you know damage the plastic or anything you know i ran these boards across the top kind of for snow load and stuff like that i've added the exhaust fan right now the only ventilation i have is my screen door here um, i'm going to come in and probably cut some holes in this tin and put screen across there that way i've got more airflow coming in i'll probably do it at multiple areas here around the around the greenhouse um, the plastic I ordered from, I think it was Bootstrap Farmer, and I did do a double layer of plastic for winter. Um, as you can see, I got two layers. I got a blower set up here, and it just mounts to here. So you can see the how it really pushes out there. It does a great job, and outside it just looks like a big dome going across there. That'll help tremendously in the winter with keeping it warmer in here you can see here i've got a jumper it runs from here to here to inflate this side i do need to add one more jumper back here i've got it there's just a washer missing so i need to come in and redo that to go from here to over here um you know the the ideas with the carport are kind of endless i mean what you can do in here with these things um i this was not my idea i found this idea somebody did on on youtube also so you know this is not my idea at all i just kind of take ideas i find and kind of make them my own but um i wish this was bigger now that we've done it you can already tell we're gonna we like it bigger but you know we're doing nothing but container gardening in here as you can see, this idea of the container are from uh, Gardening with Leon. I got the idea from Arms Family Homestead. Yeah, I'm even trying corn in here. I mean, it's crazy. Um, you know, the outside, sorry, it's raining out here. You know, as you can see, you got this wiggle wire that holds the plastic, holds it, do it all the way up around there, kind of around this end here also. That wiggle wire works really good holding that plastic and i've had to take it apart a couple times you know just to fix a few areas but it comes off and put it back on real easy so yeah you can kind of design your own deal however you want to do it this is just kind of my deal the way i did it and it seems to be working out pretty good so but anyway if you have any questions I mean, this is a, we just finished this up last night also, our water collection, to, so we can run water into the greenhouse here. And we'll have plenty of water from now on, so we don't have any running water down here at the shop. So, um, anyway, if you have any questions, let me know. Hope that helped a little bit. Uh, if not, then we'll kind of do the best we can answering any questions you have. So, other than that, we'll talk to you later. Bye.